Hey guys, Jason here with Hatfield Country. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're going to be planting our Kennebec seed potatoes. Uh, it's been pretty wet off and on most of the spring. We haven't even had an opportunity to get out here and till. Uh, today I lightly tilled already, but uh, I'm going to till up a spot here to plant these. I've got the depth on my tiller as deep as it'll go. Uh, you want the soil to be as loose as possible so that they, uh, they have plenty of room to grow and are not obstructed or anything. So I'm going to get to tilling. All right, so now we got that all tilled. Uh, ground was perfect today. I don't know if you saw our video last year. I think it was maybe our second video. I tried to come out here and till, and it was just too wet, and it was a mess. So I'm really happy how, how the ground is. So now what I'm gonna do, I got some uh, wooden stakes, some string, and I'm gonna lay out my rows. So I think I'm gonna do two rows. Um, I'm gonna have them three feet apart because you want to have enough you want to have enough room in between to gather dirt because when as they're growing you're gonna heal them up so if you had them too close you wouldn't have no dirt in between so I'm gonna make sure to have enough in there so now I'm just gonna lay out my rows here. So now I'm just going to make a furrow down this string here to get that in place. I'll move my string over three feet and make another. Wish I had one of those fancy wheel hoes to just go down the row flickety split. Anybody wants to send me one, I'll take it. Alright guys, so we got everything tilled, laid out, furrows made, ready to put the seed potatoes in. Um, here they are. If you've seen our video where I had them cut up and laid out, drying, they're good and ready. So uh, we're going to place them in the furrow six inches apart. Then we're going to cover them with about two to three inches of soil. You want to make sure that the eyes are facing up. That's what's going to grow up out of the ground and give you your plant. So you want to make sure that those are facing up. So now we're going to put these in furrows. Alright, got everything laid in the furrows. I did this one, Scouty did that one. Now I'm going to show her Scout. Scout. Now I'm going to cover up mine, uh, like two or three inches of dirt. I'm not going to measure, it'll be good because I'm going to heal them as they grow. So I'm just going to rake all this loose soil right on top of them. And then I'll, I'll come back up this other side and rake in this pile of dirt. Hey guys, me and actually did me and Dad can't do this because it's raining. It's and not actually, raining now. Well, it was raining, right, and right. teamwork makes the dream work. So now we'll probably come back in a couple weeks. I'm sure the 
probably start coming up. I'll throw some fertilizer and maybe I'll do a video showing you all the type of fertilizer we're going to use. Until then, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. See ya. Thanks for watching, guys.